Hi everyone, this is the tutorial for your whereabouts. My name is Billy from Piano Pies, let's get stuck straight in. Okay, so we just need four chords to get through this song. However, there are a few little minor differences along the way, so make sure you stick around to find out how to exactly play this track. Now the first chord that we have is an A major chord, which is an open A string, two, two, two on the D, G, B, and then an open E string. That's the first chord. We'll talk about strumming in just a moment. The second chord, an open E major chord, which is an open E string, two, two on the A and D string, one on the G, open B and E strings. We then have one bar chord of F sharp minor, which is two, four, four, and then this finger picks up the bottom three strings on fret two. Now we have one, technically two new chords. D major is uh, one of the chords, which is an open D string, two on the G, three on the B, two on the high E which sometimes will resolve up to a D sus4 chord, which is where we take this little finger, put it on fret three of the E string. So it's taking that note of the D chord and just putting that finger on there to replace it. And that makes it a D sus4. Okay, so those chords in that order is gonna get you through all of the song. However, sometimes we strum chords, sometimes we sustain, we're gonna talk through that now. And in terms of strumming, we have the same type of strumming for every chord in the opening section of the song, which is this. So what I'm doing is playing down, down, up, down, up for each chord twice. But the second down is more emphasized. It's got a bit more of an accent to it, a push. Down, down. And the first, I'm just focusing on the lower strings of the chord. It's really small details that we're adding in here, but it makes it sound just like the track, so we'll try and do the same. Now, those four chords, technically five, like I said, will get you through most of the song. However, at times, they add in an extra bar of D major with the D sus4, sometimes they don't. Um, if you want the full thing wrought out professionally in a chord chart form, as well as chords and lyrics matched up, then head on over to Patreon. There's a link in the description. You get everything wrought out, and it saves you from trying to memorize where those extra bars of D are, or trying to remember the full set of chords in its exact order so yeah feel free to check that out and it saves you from yeah memorizing all because if you're anything like me i'm terrible at memorizing now during that introduction after you've played those four chords and you've got to the d major they do have that extra bar of d sus4 and then d like this then here it comes d sus4 back to d I'll just play that D sus4 bar once more and watch out for that little finger. Notice how I'm playing once around the strumming pattern for D sus4 and then once for D. Now in the first verse we have sustained chords. So we play the same chords in the same order but sustaining them as in letting them ring out. One, two, three and two, three and two, three, and two, three, four. Do that twice round for the first verse and then add on an extra bar of D major where you build it up. And you've got yourself the full first verse. Now I'm not gonna try and pad out this video, basically just listen to the song and watch out whether it's sustained or whether it's strummed, whether there's an extra D sus4 or not, and then you've got the full song. If you are wanting everything right out so you don't have to really listen out for it, you can just follow it along on a sheet, then like I said, head on over to Patreon. Uh, just for a few dollars you get access to not only this song, but over 300 other songs that I've made for the latest releases over the past few years, including his amazing song, Arkansas Diamond. So feel free to check that out. Thanks to the people on the screen, those are my active patrons. So the moment this video goes live, they get access to this content straight away. So thanks to them, thanks to you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.